Hi folks, I'm Chief Meteorologist Jay Bershback along with scientist, Chief Scientist Carl Nelson here at the Imagination Station and today we're outside dealing with water, water rockets. rockets and exactly. at the end of this experiment we'll talk about how folks at home can actually do exactly what we're doing right down here at the Imagination Today, Station. Today, actually. Okay, yes. great. Yeah. Okay. So this is our annual water rocket challenge. We provide all the materials and visitors come down and provide the labor and the engineering expertise to turn a two liter bottle filled with a little bit of water okay. into a rocket. Okay, so let's show right. them how we do it here. So this is the uh, very low tech, non-engineered way of doing this because this rocket has no fins, it has no counterbalancing weight, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna pressurize it with a little bit of air from this bicycle pump. Okay. We're gonna add pressure inside the bottle and you just keep pumping. At some point, I'm gonna release it. That's gonna force the water out of the rocket. Newton's third law of action, third law of motion for every action equal and opposite reaction. Right. Give it like four more pumps. One, I think we're good two. to go. In fact, did you wanna do the honors of pull, sure. pulling this cord straight down? Yank it fast? Yep. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Wow. A nice blast of water wow. and you get a tumbling rocket, okay? Because okay. we didn't really think that through too well. We didn't add any fins for stability and we didn't add a counterweight on the inside. Okay, what the so counterweight there's... does is it moves the center of gravity okay. further forward in the rocket so that it has a little bit more stability. Sure. Now I'm hoping this guy, which is still pretty crude, might perform a little bit better than our, our just well, sort of first one went naked two liter bottle. At least uh, 75, 100 feet, so that was impressive. All right, so we just Up push this down. Okay. Engage our cable ties. Uh, so keep pumping her up, Jay. Pumping. What are you up to there, like 30 PSI? 30, Let's 35. see if we can shoot for 40. Oh, Carl, putting me to work. It's getting harder and uh, harder as you add more pressure. 40. All right. Okay, are Think you ready? ready? I'm ready. All right, here we go in three, three. two, one. Pull. Whoa! <laughs> we almost hit the kids out <laughs> in the grass there. You got and, a little uh, wet? And that, I got some uh, some rocket fuel on me, you know, but also known as water. That's but, the hey, fun, great. That is the fun part of what we're doing down here. We are showing people how to think about a problem, such okay. as getting a water rocket to travel a long distance. We're actually gonna have some prizes for people, have targets set up, okay. people can build their rockets. Go ahead and pump one more time. Okay, Let's get this go. guy out there. So this has a couple of extra fins. This has four fins, and okay. I don't know if that's gonna make a difference or not, and that's the beauty of this, is that you can try so many different variables, you can try so many different things. We're at about, at about 40. Give it four more. Carl, if you can. Give me the hard work today. <laughs> All right, I'll let, I think I think we've right. reached capacity. Go ahead okay. and give that guy a pull. There we go. Are you ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Pull. Whoa! Wow. Oh man, look at that. We <laughs> <laughs> hit the building. Okay. So, so four fins, that. man. That's the way to wow. do it. That one, wow. if you come to the Imagination Station, the outside area, yeah. that went off the building where I believe Prometica is going to be. Yeah, located this soon. old steam plant. Yeah. Amazing. That one nice. flew nice and straight, too. That's nice, yeah. All right, absolutely. so go over once again. Today, folks, can Today's come down and, and, and get a nice little <laughs> shower. You don't have to, but uh, but what's going yeah. on today? Exactly? Today's our water rocket challenge. Come down. We've got all the supplies. We've got the rocket launchers. You can do what we just did. Build your own rocket. Try some different variations. Design it really cool. Come out. Test it. We'll have target set up, and the rocket that gets closest to the target, we've got prizes. Awesome. It's just a fun family event. Lots of engineering. Lots of fun. <laughs> you get wet. You get cooled off. It's it's just crazy. It's it fun. is cool. And that last one was impressive. That's amazing. Yeah. yeah. Awesome stuff. Okay. For Carl Nelson, yeah. thank you so much. I am Chief Meteorologist Jay Bershback. That was magic.